ICC NTA is an accredited third-party agency and part of the International Code Council's family of solutions. ICC provides code evaluation, product certification, inspection, engineering, plan review testing services, and independent quality and standard compliance verification for building product manufacturers. With offices, testing labs, and training facilities in Napanee, Indiana, and Bryan, Texas, ICC NTA serves residential and commercial builders, code officials, manufacturers, and suppliers throughout the building industry. The large-scale vertical and horizontal furnaces are used to measure fire resistance. Fire resistance is the ability of a material, product, or assembly to withstand fire or give protection from a fire for a period of time. Typically, these apparatuses test passive fire protection materials on vertical or horizontal assemblies such as walls, doors, floors, ceilings, roofs, dampers, fire stops, structural columns, structural beams, and other assemblies with a vertical or horizontal orientation. Passive fire protection assemblies are intended to compartmentalize a fire and prevent the spread of fire from one side of the assembly to the adjacent or unexposed side. The time needed for preventing such an occurrence is determined by the codes, such as the ICC International Building Code IBC, and used by various jurisdictions. There are many standards that utilize these furnaces. The standards are developed by Standard Development Organizations (SDOs) such as the ASTM, EN, BS, UL, ULC, and many others that are used in different countries or jurisdictions. The main difference between these standards are the fire curves used to expose the test assembly, the instrumentation used, and the structural integrity requirements of the tested assemblies. ICC NTA's facility can test passive fire protection materials to ASTM E119, UL263, ULC S101, UL1709, BS476, EN1363, ASTM E814, US Department of Defense MIL Standard 3020, and many more. Unlike small-scale tests that measure material flammability properties of a single product, these furnaces test entire assemblies which are comprised of individual products or components. In the United States, the typical test method, ASTM E119, is used for complying with code requirements for fire resistance. This test exposes an assembly to a standard fire controlled to achieve specified temperatures throughout a specified time while measuring the assembly's ability to resist significant temperature transmission while also maintaining a load if warranted. When required, the fire exposure is followed by the application of a specified standard fire hose stream in accordance with ASTM E2226. This practice is applicable to building elements required to be subjected to the impact, erosion, and cooling effects of a hose stream as part of a fire test response standard.